My name's Mike Sandling, I'm the uh, Managing Director of Crime Scene Investigation Equipment Limited, based in the UK. Uh, my background is law enforcement. I joined the Metropolitan Police in 1957, would you believe? And after 30 years, uh, with my son, we formed this company. Originally it was uh, canine scene of crime equipment, but we changed the name because of popularity. <laughs> of course, in our day, DNA was not, wasn't even known. It was only in recent years that it's come to the fore. And everybody thinks today how easy it is, but it's not. However, I've been impressed with the MVAC, which I've seen now. Uh, I think the way it's being used and can be used will be uh, very beneficial. I can see a lot of potential for that in the investigation of crime. Not only the investigation of crime, but in the recovery of the evidence that we need. Because today, more and more of the public, juries, the judiciary, are all looking for forensic information, not necessarily coming from some old policeman like me. It, it's a sort of modern phenomenon, isn't it, really, DNA? Uh, people are looking at it more and more to do the job. It, uh, there are problems with DNA because you've got to have DNA to start with, haven't you? Uh, we've relied mainly on fingerprints, on shoe prints, but the whole gambit of crime scene investigation now has moved on amazingly. And there's no doubt that something like MVAC and other things that we use now are really making an impact into the work that we do.